Hello, this is Steph. Welcome to my channel. So today we're going to see how to create test videos. Test videos are really useful if you don't have any videos. You want to test your encoder, decoder, you uh, developed something and you would like to um, uh, have an input for uh, the things that you are developing. Uh, FMPEG provides also this. So you can create test videos out of FMPEG and um, Ubuntu ready behind me and so now we're ready to get started okay so now to create our test videos uh, what we like to do is to use uh, the so-called LAVFI left fee so this is uh, the virtual field uh, that is available on the FFM tag so to have uh, a description we can take uh, FMPEG, we hide the banner by using the hide banner flag, and then we take the list of formats. In this case, we have all the list of formats available. Uh, what we want is specifically the LAVFI. Um, so we can take the graph LAVFI, and here we have the Libre filter virtual input device. So we can take uh, FMPEG to create a video. In this case, uh, the first video we're going to create is uh, uh, a test that looks like uh, the old TV, um, no signal, no program uh, thing of the test videos that was uh, pretty colorful, so with the color flashing and uh, the timestamp also. That's called uh, test SRC. So first of all, uh, we invoke FMPEG with a format LABFI. Then uh, the minus I is a test SRC. Here with test SRC, we have uh, the function that is similar to a field that so we got to put our parameters. So, first of all, we have the duration. Duration is, uh, let's say, 15 seconds. Then uh, we got to separate. Uh, sorry, here we got to put an equal, so duration equals to 15, then colon, and the next parameter. In this case, so the size is equal to, let's say, 1280 by 720. And then uh, the frame rate. The frame rate is set with the rate parameter. In this case, let's say 60 frames per second. And then we got to decide where to create our file. So we go to home test src dot uh, mkv uh, here we put in the videos since uh, we always used to use the videos folder and uh, I think everything's okay we can set you see that uh, now the command is uh, running so 15 uh, uh, by 600 you have uh, 900 frames so we're going to wait until we have uh, the 900 frames so here we go, the thing is a bit uh, uh, slower since I'm working on a, a solar hard drive, but uh, for you it may be faster. Also the encoding takes a bit of time. And here we go. So we have it there and ready. So here we can open it and uh, you will see that there is a, a timestamp as we wanted. So. We have this uh, cool feature with these colors and uh, these timestamps. So cool. Of course, if you want to use other resolutions, other frame rates, you can select this command. You can take uh, the things you want. So if you want, for example, 5.5 seconds with a size that is, uh, let's say, 352 by 288 uh, with a frame rate of uh, 15 frames per second, uh, the software will uh, do this so this is our c2.mkv and it will do it here we have this so with a smaller video with uh, the size as you the size that you wanted another super cool video that you can create uh, is called uh, smpt bars so this is a uh, static it's not like the one that we saw uh, before and the common is more or less the same. So we've got to take uh, FMPEG, then uh, minus F 
LFUFI to the virtual filter, minus I, in this case, uh, we're going to call uh, the different uh, name of the filter. So uh, the, the name of the uh, input, so SMPTE bars equals, and here all the parameters that we saw before. So duration, Okay, so let's take uh, 10 seconds. Sorry, after the parameter, got to put an equal, the name of the parameter, equal uh, value. Then size uh, equals to, uh, let's say, 1280 by 720. And uh, the frame rate, rate is equal to, let's say, 60 frames per second. And then the name of the output file, so home, videos and then smpt bars dot uh, this time let's say mp4 so here it's going to get created we can stop the process if you would like with the q key but uh, we can bring it till the end and here you see that the video is slightly different so this is static we see the colors uh, like uh, the classic test videos on uh, TV. Another source that you can take in consideration is uh, the um, the unique color. So you can select a unique color and put there on the screen. And uh, this can be done by using FMPEG and again LABFI. In this case, the input will be uh, the name color. Color equals to C equals to the name of the color so you can put the blue green red uh, pink uh, purple etc so the color you would like let's say um, blue here if you would like you can put uh, an ampersand and uh, the uh, value of the opacity so you can take uh, a value from uh, 0 to 1 but uh, let's say 0 0.5 as an opacity uh, going through then a column name so duration of the video in this case let's say five seconds then uh, the resolution with the size as before take uh, 1280 by 720 and uh, a frame rate uh, of uh, uh, let's say uh, 25 frames per second then the folder and uh, the video so here you can say blue color dot uh, mkv so it's getting created as you can see you have uh, your wonderful blue video Of course, if you would like, you can also okay, remove here the uh, opacity. Well, let's say um, duration like this, rate like this. And I would like to show you also that uh, some of the parameters uh, can be shrunk. So instead of size, you can put S. Instead of rate, you can put R. And uh, it works uh, anyway. In this case, it would tell if you want to overwrite um let's say yes and you will see that uh, in the end uh, the file will be the same the last but not least video in this uh, uh, category can be the um so so called uh, rgb test src so you have uh, three bands red green and blue in this case uh, you can do whatever you want so fmpeg minus f LABFI, then uh, the minus i in this case is test, uh, sorry, RGB um, test SRC. Then uh, we have, uh, uh, if you would like, you can specify the pixel format, pixel FMP. Um, in this case, let's take uh, the classic one that is available in video, so YUV 40p minus T. Uh, let's say 30 frames per second and uh, in the end we have uh, this uh, uh, RGB no, first of all we've got to put the folder home videos 
and uh, let's see RGB test SRC dot uh, MP4 let's say in the end the video is created so of course you can put uh, the um, um it's a deep type of codec if you would like you want you can put the resolution so this by default let's see how much is it so here the resolution is uh, um 320 by 240 but if you would like as before you can put uh, the resolution in this case uh, um Let's see if it works like this. So duration, let's say uh, 10 seconds. We remove the other thing. Then uh, we take uh, uh, the video size. With the size uh, is 1280, 720. And uh, the frame rate, we also remove the pixel format. So I think by default, we put YOV420. And uh, then uh, the rate that is uh, let's say 60 frames per second let's see it works uh now we want to put another file okay and it will be created let's wait until the process is done and uh, let's hope that uh, the output will be the one that uh, uh, we set yes so here we've got the size and the resolution so you saw that uh, the sizes can be put uh, uh, both as uh, options in uh, fmpeg as they were or as parameters of our input so the duration the um, frame rate etc can be put uh, in uh, both ways so far we talked about uh, creating test videos so there are some ideas I hope that you liked it. Um, so if you don't have any samples at hand and you would like to create some, uh, there are some ideas. So no, uh, means to be the um, lifesaver of all your chances, but uh, it can be a good thing just to, if you would like to create uh, a video of your own, uh, just to test uh, something that you got uh, on the fly. So for the moment, uh, thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much for watching. If you're right to this point, like, share and subscribe and hit the notification bell if you would like to get notified about uh, the latest uh, uh, videos. And uh, uh, follow my social media um, on Instagram and TikTok. For the moment, uh, I thank you very much and see you next time with a content delay with uh, multimedia and much, much more. Ciao. Ciao.